Scientific research has shown that when you dwell on a god of love for just 12 minutes a day, it improves the altruism circuits of the brain. It grows your frontal lobe. But how do you do that? Here's one little exercise that will help. First, simply take the Bible verse, God is love. Just three words from 1 John 4, verse 8. God is love. That is the very definition of his character. So this shouldn't be difficult. You can study the life of Christ and you see the picture of God's love manifest. But now simply take 1 Corinthians 13. This is a little exercise we're going to do together. 1 Corinthians 13 is the famous love chapter where it says love is kind, love is patient, and so on. And since God is love, just take the name God and insert it into 1 Corinthians 13 where it references love each time. So, for example, we'll do it together. God suffers long and is kind. God does not envy. God does not parade himself. God is not puffed up. God does not behave rudely. God is not self-seeking. God is not provoked. God thinks no evil. God does not rejoice in iniquity. God rejoices in the truth. God bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. God never fails. Now you can take some time with each one of those. Open your physical Bible and try it. Pray to God over each one of these items to reveal himself to you and think of Jesus in Gethsemane, before Pilate, before the mob, ridiculed, tortured, and then suspended in the air on a torture device that would make the, what the Dark Ages church did look like child's play. So patient, so kind refusing to save himself, bearing all things. Jesus never fails.